Hey guys and welcome to another episode of Kingdom Pets channel. Today we're going to be talking about the Dalmatian, which is also known as the carriage dog, the spotted coach dog, leopard carriage dog, firehouse dog, plum pudding dog and the Dal. Heading straight into it, the beloved Dalmatian is a highly distinctive breed with a striking spotted coat, which is white and black. These elegant dogs combine a playful personality with great versatility and thus historically have been known in a range of roles. Some of these roles describe them as for hunting and riding, as for farm dogs and watchdogs, as circus performers, firehouse dogs and carriage dogs. And that's basically what they got their abbreviated names from. And more recently, they are known as the companions. They are sometimes reserved with strangers and are okay Occasionally aggressive towards other dogs, but are intelligent and trainable. The history of the Dalmatian breed is an interesting read. Although Dalmatians are mostly associated with England and the United States, records of spotted dogs have appeared in Italian Renaissance art and even in artifacts from ancient Egypt. In the 16th century, a letter written by Serbian poet Giorgi Dalmatin refers to two spotted Turkish dogs that he bred perhaps creating the first Dalmatian. Since the 16th century in England, they were favoured as coaching dogs, acting as guards for unattending coaches and horses to deter highwaymen. Dalmatians became known as English couch dogs or spotted dicks across the Atlantic in the United States. They became known as the firehouse dogs, as they, as they were used to accompany early fire trucks running ahead of them to clear the way. In 1951, the National Fire Protection Association designated the Dalmatian named Sparky as their first official mascot. Following the release of Disney's 101 Dalmatians in 1961, the popularity of the breed increased significantly and has been in a popular companion ever since then. A quick snippet of this amazing breed's portfolio is that their life expectancy is an average of 10 to 13 years of age. Their country of origin is from Croatia. Croatia is officially the Republic of Croatia, is a country at the crossroad of Central and Southeast Europe on the Adriatic Sea which is near Serbia, Slovenia, and just across the sea of Italy. These dogs are extremely intelligent, playful, friendly, outgoing, energetic and sensitive. The female height ranges from 56 to 58 centimeters and the male is from 58 to 61. The weight ranges from 15 kilos to 32 kilos for both the females and males and majority of the colors come in liver and white and then black and white which is the Dalmatian's universal color. In terms of their training regimens, like every other dog and throughout all my other videos, all dogs require discipline and consistency so that they can be able to interact with people without any aggression, feed aggression and even to eliminate things such as separation anxiety. The Dalmatian dog is no, no different. Although being an easier breed of dog to train, they're affectionate and they're very playful but they do still require that discipline and consistency from the owners so they can grow up to be an amazing and companions, friendly dogs and also be able to socialize with others and not develop aggression of any sort. Naturally they are an amazing breed of children but since they have that guarding and defensive outlook of life to protect what's dear to them they may see other dogs as a threat. Their grooming regimen is very low because they are a short hair breed and they do require a lot of exercise. So taking them for walks around three to five times a week would be at a minimum. Running down into their medical conditions, the Dalmatians breed usually have problems including deafness, bladder stones, skin problems and other forms of allergies. One of the easiest way or most common way for people that usually have dogs to notify or to be able to tell if their dogs have bladder stones is that majority of the time when they urinate is there's, there's blood in the urine or sometimes they are straining to even urinate. Hematuria is what it's called and it occurs because the stones rub against the bladder walls, irritating and damaging the tissue, causing bleeding, which is then foreseen when they are urinating or struggling to urinate. And circling back to the types of allergies they have, in dogs rather than sneezing, allergies make their skin itchy. We call this allergy atopy and the Dalmatian breed has a lot of it. When they have allergies, their feet, belly, falls of their skin and ears are most commonly affected. These type of symptoms and itching are picked up at the age of 1 to 3 and can get worse throughout their years. Besides the possibility of having allergies, the Dalmatian also has skin issues or skin problems which is sometimes confused with itching. You may notice that your dog has dry scaly skin with patches of hair loss along the top of their head, back or their neck or sometimes along their back. This condition typically develops when your dog is between 1 and 5 years of age. And I'd advise to take them to the nearest veterinarian so they can go through a progressive medical treatment and get them back to being themselves. And just some closing remarks and interesting facts about the Dalmatians that the Dalmatian puppies are born snow white 
purely and do not grow their spots until they're about four or five weeks old so thanks again for watching guys and i'll see you in the next episode of kingdom pest channel